even turning the wheel. Other hackers opening car doors with ease. Turning the wheel. Told you. Told you what they did to me. The government was working on hacking cars too. The CIA was looking at infecting the vehicle control system used by modern cars and trucks. The purpose of such control is not specified. The new leaked documents quoting a meeting of the CIA. It's Thursday morning. Devices branch. Potential March 9, 2017. At approximately 7:45 a.m. So first we're gonna turn the fan on him. The driver of this Jeep Cherokee losing control. Something just turned on all the fans and AC and stuff. I didn't do that. These two hackers say they're controlling the car remotely, turning on the windshield wipers, turning on the radio. The air conditioning is blasting. The music is blasting. The hackers even controlling the steering, then going even further. Kill the engine. <laughs> so we're killing the engine right now. Actually, it's accelerated. The first point is the four miles an hour, but I'm not going that fast. Responding to that video, the maker of Jeep telling NBC News it's committed to the safety and security of our vehicles. We continue to take proactive steps to address cyber risks, adding the vulnerability discovered by those hackers has been eliminated. This is Stan J. Caterbone, Advanced Media Group, www.amg, globalentertainmentgroup.com. Again, this is today's show, March 9th. 2017, 7.50 a.m. We're talking about taking over your car remotely, which they did to me several times, especially when the Honda CRV crashed into the black metal fence there at the corner of Lime, Lime and James Street the night before I turned the car in. They also did it to me several times on the turnpike. Yes, I just started the car. So now I'm a thief in your car, driving away within seconds, all because of this little device. It's terrifying how fast this is. Wow. And it's not just this car. Experts using the device on car after car after car, breaking into and even starting 17 different makes and models. The Alliance of Automobile Manufacturers told NBC News protecting vehicle access and security continue to be top priorities and automakers have been working on multiple fronts to address security and enhance it. Bottom line, what's the takeaway here? Well, as we get more and more internet connected devices in our houses, you know, smart cars, smart refrigerators, smart washing machines, we have to assume that every one of those things is going to be vulnerable to hackers. Here's the thing. Hackers are smart and they are fast at coming up with new ways to control our stuff. The car companies are really trying their best to keep up. So here's the takeaway for you. If you get a software update, if your car is connected to the to the Internet wirelessly and you get a software update from the car company, from your washing machine company, anything connected to the Internet, and you authenticate the software upgrade is from the company, guys, you want to download that update immediately before you hit the road because it could contain some important hack fixes. Mm -hmm. All right, good information, Jeff. Thank you Thanks, so much. Jeff. Coming up, too.